Hi everyone, Wincy here from Arthur Randomness. Uh, today I'm opening up a box of Commander Legend Collector's Booster. So uh, um, this is actually a, a very interesting collector booster because the prices has been going up and down, up and down. So um, let's see whether we will be able to get the uh, Chase Mythic out of this box. And for those who don't know what the Chase Mythic is, it's actually the Extended Art Jeweled Lotus. Boy. So without further ado, let's crack this baby open. Pardon me for my messy desk, yeah? Lots of stuff on the table. So let's uh, put this aside. Open the very first pack. This one seems to have a very good. Uh, I don't know why it's not, not bending and everything. Maybe this box is a bit different from somewhere. Let me see where this comes from, okay? Oh, it's made in the USA. Hmm, okay, interesting. Alright, so first we have Champion of the Flame, Deranged Assistant, Barhaven Elf, Howling Golem, All Celebrants, Skilled Animator. Oh, we have an upgrade, Terminal Battle Rage, Foyer Extended Art. And then we have Kuski, the Flash Sculptor, that's one of our two legendary foils. Bitches. And then the next one is a Mythic. Oh, we have a Rejuvenating Spring Extended Art. Wow, nice. It's a very good upgrade. And then we have our Uncommon. We have a Breed. And then we have, oh my god, Uncommon <laughs> Extended Art. Wow. And then we have our Edge Foils, a Kiwi Line Slinger, Eligaf, and Asior. Wow, this is a good pack. A very good start actually at the beginning. Put the Edge Foils here on the side. Foil token. Okay. Going on to our second pack. A Blade Brand, Cissé's Ring, Path of Ancestry, Ramaging Goblin, Supernatural Stamina, Strength of the Pack, Coastline Marauders, and then we have our two legends. We have Rayev, the Master Smith, we have Latil, the Bounteous Dawn, and the rare is Immaculate Magistrate. No upgrades for this pack, unfortunately. And then we have the counter spell extended up. Mm, nice. And Sakashima's Wheel. Okay. Nice. And then we have our Edge Foil. We have Master Smith. Cedar Kondo. And. Balbi. Okay. Not too scruffy. And a social token with a dragon behind. Okay. Third pack.
Ancient Animus, Charcoal Diamond Foil, that's nice. Finket Fugitive, Command Tower Foil, that's good too. Seraph of Dawn, Hero's Blade, and a Frenzied Saddle Brute. And then our two um, Legendary Foils. Following that, we have a rare. It's the Jeskar's Wheel. This is a nice rare to hit as well. Quite a valuable rare. An uncommon Reliquary Tower. Extended art. And the extended art rare is Wrong Turn. Looks like things took a wrong turn here. <laughs> Been wanting to say that for a while. And then we have Ikra Shiriki and Obeka. Okay. Alright. Let's uh clear out the piles here again. Pack number four. Okay, so we have Scholar of Stars, Fire Diamond, nice, Renegade Tactics, Knife Patrol, Workshop Assistance, Armor Craft Judge, and a Extended Art Counter Spell again, wow! But this time it's a foil with an upgrade, and then we have Anara, Warbit Familiar, Second Rare, Alina Cassic Trapper, and the Rare, let's hope we have an upgrade. Nope, we don't have an upgrade, but um, it's a mythic. Seraph, great sword. Not the best mythic, but hey, mythic is a mythic. No complaints there. Kodama's reach, extended up. And a sweet gum recluse. Well, we have our edge foils. We have a team now, not too bad. That's a good edge foil. That's a money card right here. And then we have the Ninja Toto. Okay. Sorry. Took it out of frame by chance. So we have Phosphor Denial, Molder Beast, Benevolent Blessing, Sears Lantern, Rapture Spire, Mass of Memory, Warden of Evil at all. No upgrades there by the way. So we have the Legendaries. And then the rare for the slot, do we have nope, we don't have extended art, but it's a nightshade harvester. Okay. Oh. And we have Swift Foot Boots and the rare is War Room. Mm. We have the lease and we have Cadell and we have Alivio. For the edge foil. Okay. okay. I need to put this here and this as well. Always oh, getting the pulse mixed up. Okay. We have six packs. These are six packs. Sail Corsair, Dun Operative, Crimson Fleet Commodore, Dispeller Capsule, Prismatic Piper, Victimize, Siren Storm Tamer, and we have a two legendaries. And let's see whether our rare has been upgraded. Oh, it's upgraded rare. What do we have here? Oh, Aurora Phoenix. 
it's in not a not rare that I want upgraded, but upgraded rare is upgraded rare. We have a Terramorphic Expense, extended art, and then we have another rare of uh, Court of Bounty. This is a good court as well. We have Halana, Kessig Ranger, Berserker, and Lethew. Nice. Okay. Alright, half the box in. Still have another six packs to go. Will we hit the chase card of the box? Let's see. We have Boarding Party, Flynn Elves, Defiant Salvager, Preordain, Dark Enrage, Burning Anger, Law Seeker Stone. And then we have the two legendaries. See the rare. Oh, it's a mythic. It's an upgraded one too. We have a Hell Kite Corsair extended art. Okay. Arcane Denial extended art. And the rare we have Kamal's Will. Okay, we have Prismatic Piper again. And we have Nichila and Yolok. This is an 8 pack in, yeah? 8 pack. So we have Squad Captain, Nadir's Nightblade, Flower of Duty, and then we have the two rares, Rograph and Brian Lin. Let's see whether our rare has been upgraded. Nope, it has not been upgraded. So it's just a Root Weaver Druid. Let's put this power here on the side. Baji reaches and they slash the ranks. So we have Kadis, a Ludovic, and a Sakashima Thousand Faces. Wow, this extended art is uh, this this uh Ash Four is worth a lot of money by the way. Look at that in its glory by the way. Look at that, isn't it gorgeous? This card is worth so much right now. Okay, not too bad. So far, we have uh, the bigger hitters are the Hina, Sakashima, and the and the um, what's that again? And the Vampiric Tutor, yes. Crow of Dark Tidings, Kite Sail Commissioner, Amorphous Axe. Inspiring Roar, Spark Harvest, Pride of the Perfect, Kangi's Lieutenant, Emoti, Alaru. Do we have an upgrade here? Do we have an upgrade? Yes, nope, we don't. Well, it's a Hal Bridger for it. No complaints there. Eh? It's a good uh, rare as well in this slot. And then we have the command tower extended art and a rejuvenating spring as well yeah oh yeah i forgot about it we have an extended art juve rejuvenating spring foil as well down okay we have ribback and we have karametra and kodama of the e3 okay some good edges there okay we have three more packs to go Let's get the bolters, come on. Where's the alarm? I be Denizen, Welding Sparks, Panon Blade, 
and we have a upgraded Kumbaji Witches, Halana Kessik, Liaza Shock of Dust, and we have a upgraded rare Sakashima's Will. Hmm. Okay. And then we have a Mouth Rifter. And a Laboratory Drudge. And we have Emoti, Hashfoy, Ishai, Ojutai, and Jared. All the squeaky packs. We have Prying Eyes, Eye Blade Assassin, A Millery Sphere, Dragon Egg, Soul Smite, Horizon Scholar, Sandstone Oracle, and then we have our two rare, sorry, I mean the two legendaries. Let's see if we have upgrades. Nope, we don't. But it's a foil commander beacon. Command beacon, I mean, sorry. Extended Art Terminal Battle Rage and a Extended Art Rare Call of Grace. Then we have Tormod, Bruce Town, and Hans Ericsson. Aha! Uh -huh. So a tree. Okay, we are down to our last pack. Will we get anything from here? Will we? Let's see. Oops, sorry. Not the camera by accident. Got too excited for a minute. We have Cops Churn. Jalum Tom. Jonas Judgment, Flashback Marauder, Trove Tracker, Faith Feather, Hunter's Insight, and then we have the two legendaries, and then we have the rare. Nope, it's not upgraded. So of Eternity, and we have. Oops. Victimize, and an Ember Wall Captain. Ah, oh, dang. So we didn't get a Lotus, unfortunately. That is why it's uh, such an expensive card, I guess. So we have each Take It, Tana the Blood Sower, and Nimris, Unas Trickster, followed by a Spirit Token. Okay, so that's the cards that we have for today. Let's uh, do a little recap. And see what I've gotten. So we have an Ember Wall Captain, Extended Art, Normal Foil Rare, Victimize, Call of Grace, Termio Battle Rage, Normal Foil, Laboratory Drudge, Mount Drifter, Sakashima's Will Upgrade, Kambaji Upgrade. Rejuvenating Springs, Command Tower, Hell Breacher, Kamal's Will, Arcan Denial, Hellkite Corsa Upgrade, Call of Bounty, Paramorphic Expanse, Aurora Phoenix Upgrade, Nightshade Harvester, Sweet Foot Boots, War Room, Sweet Gum Recluse, Kodama's Reach, Seraphic Great Sword, A Counter Spell Upgrade, Red Query Tower, Wrong Turn, Jessica's Will, Immaculate Magistrate, Sakashima's Will again, Counter Spell, Upgrade, Rejuvenating Springs Upgrade, Vampiricular, and a Terminal Battle Rage Upgrade. Okay, so, um, oh, sorry, this one is here. So we have 
a total of uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 upgrades on the foil, foil slot on the, I'm sorry, the foil rare slots and the foil uncommon and common slots and then of course we have the extended arts here um, the notable pulls from here would be just the Vampiric Tutor the Counter Spell and Reliquary Tower probably Kodama's Reach maybe because these are all the um, slightly more staple cards Sweet Foot Boots, Terramorphic Expanse Court of Bounty maybe a little bit of value Arcane Denial too Command Tower and never forget the Rejuvenating Springs and yeah, the rest I guess is more towards bulk I guess and then let's talk about the Edge Foil so we have Nimbris, Tana, H, Hans Ericsson, Bruce Town, Tomot, Imori, Ishikai, Jarrett, Kodama of the H3. I think this one has a bit of value. Karometra, Rebek, Cadiz, Ludovic, Prismatic Piper, and of course one of the most big the bigger hit Sakashima. Najila is also one. Uh Mutrota is a uh, also a picked one. Latil, Talis, Cadell. Cadell is a picked one too. Timna, as I mentioned earlier. This was I think one of the first few that I caught on. Archelos, uh, Mix, Ikra, Shidiki, Obeka, Sida Kondo, Rhea, Felby, Elsio, Akiri Line Slinger, and Erika. Okay, so that's about it. Oh, and the slots that were not upgraded for the rare foils. Yeah. Jessica's Wheel, Seraphic Gip Sword, How Breacher, Common Beacon. These are the three that I think will have a bit of value. <sighs> Sorry, four. I have a bit of value. Seraphic Gip Sword, I think, is one of the very last few that has the value. The value should come like this most downwards yeah okay anyway um thank you for watching this video with me and uh, seeing me break this box if you like what you see do give me a thumbs up i'm uh, doing a giveaway soon in uh, once i hit 50 subscribers so um all the likes will help me garner more views from people who have not seen this channel yet so um, I'll implore you guys to help me to give a like to this video it will help in the algorithm and it will also bring in my goal to a 50 sub sooner where I will actually do a giveaway and as it gets closer to then I will actually uh, tell you guys what I'm gonna give away all right if not thank you for watching I'll see you in the next video bye